ladies and gentlemen, your host for this evening, Tanya Hajieva. Welcome to the Wake Up Call Show with me, Tanya Hajieva, where people from all around the world will be coming to share their inspirational stories of how they transitioned in their life from working a job they didn't like to living their true calling. You receive tips and inspirations straight from their heart. And remember, you're not what your parents tell you you are. You're not what your friends and family think you should become or what society puts onto you. It is all about you finding your true calling, your inspiration and bringing it to light. Our first guest this evening is Ewula Clarks. She has set up her business called Clarks Associate Consultancy for Health and Wellness. Good evening. Good evening thank Tanya. you. Thank you for coming this evening to share your inspirational story with us and your tips. Please um, start with what was your wake up call? My wake up call is one of many, but my focus really, my, my true passion is in health and wellness mm -hmm. and helping helping ladies or women to be better than they are, become better leaders within the community. That's part of my dream. Wow, wonderful. And what was what was the trigger? When did you actually start moving into health and wellness? I started moving into health and wellness um, whilst I was at work. I was studying to be a naturopath in alternative medicine and I've always been um, passionate or curious about herbs mm -hmm. and how they impact on your internal organ. And obviously I worked for a corporation in, in the finance department and um, for the financial institution and I could not study during the week so I only had to do it on the mm -hmm. weekends. And so I was pulled in to cover different areas of um, branches because I was in banking. And I couldn't then carry on with my studies because it was from Saturday, Sunday, 10 till 6 during the oh, weekend. Wow. Yeah, it was very heavy. Very heavy. Yes. And so I did three years, but I had the understanding of how the Chinese herbs work, mm -hmm. how to actually read your, your, the eyes, yeah. your tongue, your, and take your pulse. So that still led me into, um, still fascinated about um, knowing more. Wonderful. And when did you set up your practice? When when did you start? I um, then got led into taking. I I got into the, the my products and also mm -hmm. set up my consultancy about um, a year ago. I set up the company because I wanted to then bring into the workplace or out from the workplace things that I learned mm -hmm. within. So I took early retirement from, from the organization. And then what I learned over the, over the last um, 40 odd years of working mm -hmm. for the company was things that I'd learned I then wanted to bring into my own consultancy. Mm -hmm. So you look at um, CV interview, you look at uh, you know the HR, um, doing one-to-one -one with, with, with people, and also personal development was kind of the key factor for me. So could you please tell us more about the products? I'm very, it's very interesting. So this is the tea for everybody yeah. to know. This is the tea that helps you to get slim in a few days, few weeks. Mm -hmm. Can you please give us more information okay. about, about it? Okay, so what led me to this particular product? I was in, um, I was up north and I went to church mm -hmm. and I got given this product. Mm -hmm. And I started to take the detox, the detox tea herbal, all natural and organic. Um, allow friendly and I took it and I was actually a size 20 I was quite large but I also had a bit of um, sugar in the blood make no medical claims here but um, when I started to take the detox tea within a few days I, I, was, I, I was being cleansed but I didn't take any notice until when I went in to buy a dress and I was buying a size 18 and it fell off me a 16 trousers that drop below my waist, I'm thinking, whoa, something's going on here. So I took those back and went for a 16 frock and a size 14 trousers. That fit really snug. But I was excited to say to the lady, hold on a minute, I've been detoxing <laughs> and now I'm dropping off the weight. Wow. That was about a year or so ago. But I've kept it off. Mm -hmm. um, my levels have gone down. The, the, um, the sugar within the blood has gone down. I had a little bit of cataract at the back of my eyes and when I go for my annual checks there's nothing there and yet I was prone to have an operation and when, when I went they said I can't see anything of it and so I said okay I'll wait till my letter coming from the NHS which it did all clear 
so it's an annual check that you wow. do so nothing i used to wear glasses tanya i don't i don't now See, my I eyes to start <laughs> using it now so i don't have my eyes are clear but glasses. we have um the company is based in america yeah. and it's shipped directly to your address and we have over 50 products not just the tea but the mm -hmm. tea is our flagship mm -hmm. we've sold over a million of that tea it's all herbal all natural and it does what it say on the box it goes in and cleanses your upper respiratory and your intestinal slug. But at the same time, we also give you a 30 day money back guarantee if it doesn't wow. work. Yeah, it's, that's how good it is. My next event is this Saturday, the 9th of November. We have the um, COO coming over. Mm -hmm. John is coming from the US never been to the UK before. Oh, so that's we're quite, exciting. We're really excited. For, <laughs> so they're coming on Friday, I believe. And so we have a thing every Friday. We do a fun Friday. So we're going to be doing that here. Not sure where that will be, but the event will be at the Holiday Inn, mm -hmm. 97 Cromwell Road. Mm -hmm. um, you get off at Gloucester Road Station and you do a ride to just five minutes up the road. Registration is at 11.30. We kick off at 12 till 4. So you'll hear all the stories, you'll meet the um, people from, there's about four coming from the US. So you'll get to engage with them, there'll be products, there'll be giveaways. It's an opportunity not to be missed because A, you'll learn how to improve on your health and at the same time Christmas is coming up, everybody's yeah. going to be looking to lose weight, earn some extra income. It's a long way to payday yeah, after Christmas, yeah. But also, uh, as you said, to improve their health because yeah, I, the I've been thing. into nutrition myself, so mm. I know how important that is, it you is, know. Yeah. And nowadays with all the food that we eat, you know, it's not really rich on True. minerals yeah. and anything that we actually need, that mm -hmm. the body needs. Mm -hmm. It's not only about, mm -hmm. you know, uh, eating food, but it's not the best quality. No. And everything's sprayed exactly. to look fresh yeah. on the shelf. Everything's sprayed. The soil hasn't got the nutrients like you exactly. were just saying yeah. to, to, to give you that nutrient in your body. And the, the other thing that I'd like to say as well, everybody knows about CBD. Yeah. Now we've got the CBD infused in a separate tea, which is a shake tea. So you have the boiled tea, which this is, and you have the shake tea that you just open the sachet, put it in a little bottle of water, shake it, you're good to go. That tea is like lemonade, so I've been using that for the last two weeks, but it takes the mucus away from all your organs. So imagine clearing out the mucus. The mucus causes disease, but yeah. this tastes like lemonade. Oh, wonderful. So it's lemonade. just CBD with made from the hemp leaves, mm -hmm. so it's not the other side of THC CBD yeah, yeah, that like gives you the I know. Yeah. This is just purely mild, but it's a cannabinoid. Mm -hmm. And you know, when I was looking at this and researching for myself, because everything I like to research for myself, I fully understand that we've all got cannabinoid one and two internally. I didn't know that. Number one works on your brain, yeah. yeah? And number two works on your immunity. So imagine if you're deficient in any of those two cannabinoids, yeah, you start to get sick, don't you? Yeah. So what this does is try to put back Bring what you yeah that's exactly it love it absolutely love it wow so what are the tips from your life story and your experience that you can give to the audience that's watching us now of like maybe they're out there people that are struggling like you said mm -hmm. in the beginning that they are you know going to a school after work or they're like hassling life and they you know, they're going through what you've already been, mm -hmm. you know, what tips can you give? I think first, one of my biggest tips was follow what you believe in your dreams, make a, a plan and set a goal and an action as to what you want to do, what is your next step, but also get yourself a mentor. Mm -hmm. I have a few mentors, there's mentor for personal, there's mentor for business. Yeah. So get yourself a mentor that you can talk or discuss any issues that you think, oh, I want to try this, but I'm not sure. So you're you're actually um, back burning off somebody else's um, sharing your ideas. Mm -hmm. Also, make sure you network because that's where you're going to get your ideas. So go to events, meet different mm -hmm. people, get a business card, but don't throw it away because that person that you connected with could be your connector for the next thing that you're looking to do. So I would say just focus. Wow. Yeah, this is a great tip. Mm -hmm. And what would you say was your toughest moment like to get to where you're now I'm still on my journey I, mm -hmm. I wouldn't I don't put anything as tough mm -hmm. for me because if it's not for it's not to be it's not to be yeah. I don't focus on the negative that mm -hmm. wasn't meant to be so I'll move on next 
So True. you've got to have your plan B, not always a plan A will yeah. work. So the focus is you've always got to work on the mind. Yeah, that was meant to be. You've got to get yourself into a positive mindset. So, you know, the likes of Tony Robbins, those guru, yeah. I yeah. tend to read and I go to their events. You know, other people who are strong in the networking. Mm -hmm. Look at the people that you want to associate yourself to be like and follow or, you know, do some of the courses. So if it's not happened and it's then next, that's yes. how I look at it. So I don't look at anything as a struggle. I say that was a journey that I learned what I needed to have learned. Mm -hmm. Now I'm on an e another up level. It's always elevation. I don't yes, look to. That, that is true. To go back on and things. before before we uh, before we we end mm -hmm. I want you to share with us and the audience a funny story of your life something Ooh. something uplifting oh I can't think of a, a, a funny thing at this moment but I think um, what would I say I think one of the funniest thing is how I I met my husband okay the, the first time I met my husband was um, I'm originally from Birmingham which is about 200 or 100 miles away and we were I was asked to go to my friend's um, party and so he gate crashed the party and um, you know I, I kept seeing him looking directly at myself and I'm like who's he looking at yeah because <laughs> it wouldn't be somebody that I'd look at anyway you know because he, he he was he was smart but I thought what's he looking at and then he just caught, he came across and then he asked you for a dance and I'm thinking all right then <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was looking at me, yeah, right? Yeah, That's yeah. Strong. So I think, okay. But then the other person who, who was doing the DJing thought I was actually with him, but I don't even know him. So wow. he kept, yeah, he kept going, oh, I said, but I'm not with you. You know, but we've been married now for 40 years, so oh. there you go. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. That, Thank that's, you. Yeah, that's, you yeah. deserve a golden star for that. Exactly. Patience. <laughs> <laughs> It was lovely having you as a guest. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for, for coming to share your uh, inspirational story. Thank you for tuning in to the Wake Up Call Show. Make sure you see us next Tuesday from 7 p.m.